A reduction in property taxes could have some big impacts on the school system. News News Jordan Ponzio talked to members of the Baker School Board who believe this week's decision leaves the students shortchanged. Sylvia, Tuesday's school board meeting at Baker ended in a split room with members falling just one vote short of keeping property tax rates at their current level. It's like they want the public system to fail in the city of Baker. Tuesday night, school board members got into heated arguments with each other after a motion failed to keep tax rates the same. And this is the way in the thanks we get? With an increase in property values that could have resulted in increased revenues. I feel that children's education was compromised. The motion needed a supermajority vote to pass meaning four of the five school board members had to answer yes to keeping the tax rates at current levels. Instead, the board voted three to two, falling short one vote, allowing the tax rate to roll back. It means the school system will lose out on more than a quarter of a million dollars in tax revenue. School board president Joyce Burgess called the vote totally outrageous. But I do believe that if it was put, if the motion had passed, it definitely could have allowed our staff, it could have allowed them to do things that could increase enrollment. Superintendent J.T. Stroder warned the board before the vote that he would be forced to make cuts within the school system if the motion did not pass. Anytime you remove that kind of money out of your out of your budget, that means you have less resources for what's going on in the classroom. Board Vice President Monique Butler believes a personality conflict among Schroeder and two board members led to the failure. We're here for the kids. And people that signed up for this position, position we know what we were here for. Everything is done for the kids in the city of Baker. And once that millage fell, it was a complete shock. The superintendent says that if he has to make cuts, he will not eliminate classroom positions. Sylvia?